Hello everyone, this is Robert here and I want to show you guys something that I found in the iOS 13 beta 3 update. Now this phone right here, which is an iPhone 7 Plus, this is running iOS 13 beta 3. This one here is the iPhone 10s Max and it's running iOS 12.4. Now I know there's a lot of new features in iOS 13, I'm not going to go through all of those. What I'm going to do is give you guys a feature that I found or actually discovered that I've not seen anywhere on YouTube. Apple did not announce it and I've not seen it anywhere else, but I actually found it when I was doing stuff on my regular iPhone XS Max. So first thing I want to do is show you something in here and we're going to go to the settings of each one and let's go right in here. All right, so first thing I want to show you is this. You know that in iOS 13, Apple revamped the Reminders app. Now I thought it was just aesthetics. Maybe they just made it look pretty and all that, but no, if you look at this, here is iOS 12.4 and look there's only two settings in there but in iOS 13 this is the most important feature right here the today notification the only way Apple had an app badge on your reminders is if you had overdue reminders but now they will show you all your reminders for that current day whatever they are and that is that is a game changer right there I've been, I've been waiting and hoping for that to show up and I found it in here. You still have the default list, you still have the Siri and search, you still have show is overdue. You also have this little time in here, which really I don't I don't ever use it. But you know, like it says, it says set a time to show a notification when there's an all day events, but I never have all day, so it doesn't make a difference. This one thing right here, showing the today notification, that is a game changer. So in other words, if you go in here, you see that little app badge I have right there? So if let's open up the Apple folder. Right there you see I have two notifications for today. That is a game changer. That is something I've always had to use a third party app for. Because if you look in here, we'll go into the Apple one. I have two notifications today, right? But I have no app badge. There's not a single app badge in there. So that is a game changer. Now. Something else besides the app badge, because I know I wanted reminders to be included in, in the calendar as well. That's not there, or maybe it will show up when iOS 13 comes out. But something else I noticed, which I want to show you guys, is this. Okay, here I have my scheduled reminders, right? And here, I want you to keep an eye on that little app badge right there. If I go in here and I schedule a reminder, let's say, edit video. And I want to go ahead and schedule it for today. And we'll do it at 5 p.m. today. Okay, and I hit done. You notice now I have three reminders, right? And look what it did. This changed to three. Awesome, huh? No third party syncing, no waiting for iCloud, nothing. Instant. From this iOS 12.4 to iOS 13, instant app badge. Here's another beauty part too. We have the edit videos on here, correctly? I check it off, and right here, you're gonna watch, boom. Just reduce the two. Nothing I had to do manually, nothing I had to open up any apps. It works so quick and so flawlessly. That one feature alone, yes, I know Apple's gonna continue improving on reminders and so forth and all the stuff in iOS 13. But that one feature, having that app badge, I was currently using Todoist, and Todoist was taking a very long time syncing, and, and you have to refresh, and things like that. With Apple Reminders, since it's a default app built in, the syncing is easy. And this not only happens on the iPhone, this happens on the iPad, on the Mac, uh, anywhere that you have reminders, it works perfectly. So, that one feature, and that one setting, right here, Today notification. That is the feature I wanted to show you guys today because I'm almost sure there's going to be a lot more features in iOS 13 before it actually comes out in September. But just to know we have that app badge now, that is a high, huge improvement for reminders apps that we didn't have before. So that, guys, is my video for today. It's basically focused on the reminders app and what I found out that iOS 13 has, and I'm hoping Apple will improve it, add more, and maybe eventually put it into our calendars so we have reminders and calendars all together in one app. 
So if you have any questions on that, leave them below in the comments. Don't forget, you need to uh, subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification if you want to get all the new videos as they come out. Go ahead and follow me on Instagram as well. I have a lot more tips and tricks and videos on there. And I'll try to come back here and give you guys a lot more of these videos, show you more iOS 13 and things like that that come out with Apple related or products or so forth. Thank you for watching and I will catch you guys a little bit more.